Hello, today I'm going to show you how to draw these different star shapes. First open a new document, go to File, New and click OK. Let's change the fill to red. There is a couple ways you can draw a star. First click on the rectangle tool, hold and select the star tool. Now single click on the artboard and the star dialog box will open. Here you can control the star values. Illustrator's default values are the radius 1 is double the length of the radius 2 and the points are set to 5. Generally speaking, the lower the number of the radius 2, the pointier your star will be. Let's undo it. Another way to draw a star is to click on the artboard, hold and drag. While you are dragging your mouse, your star will be spinning. To prevent it from doing it, press the shift key as well. This will constrain it. Now drag the mouse in or out to get your desired size. While still holding your mouse and holding down the shift key, press the spacebar as well. Now move your mouse to reposition your star. I would recommend to memorize the keyboard shortcut. It will speed up your work tremendously. Let's undo it. Now let's recreate these stars. If you would like to follow along, feel free to download this file. I included a link to it in the description below. Let's start with the basic 5-point star. First click in the middle of this red star, hold and drag. Try to match the size of it. While still holding your mouse, press the spacebar as well and move your mouse to reposition the star. While not letting go of your mouse, release the spacebar and drag the mouse in or out to get the best fit. Finally, first release your mouse and then release the keys. Now click away to deselect. Our next star is also a 5-point star, but the points on it are a little longer. First click in the center of the orange star, hold and drag. Try to match its size. While still holding your mouse, press the Shift key to constrain it and the Alt key to align the star side's lines. Now still holding the Shift and Alt keys, press the spacebar as well and move your mouse to reposition the star. Now release the mouse and then release the keys. The next star is a 6-point star. Click in the center of the yellow star, hold and drag. Now press the up arrow key on your keyboard one time to add an extra point to it. Then drag it in or out to match the size and while still holding your mouse, press the shift key to constrain it and the alt key to align the star side's lines. Let's move on to the next star. This one has 12 points. Click in the center of it, hold and drag. While still holding your mouse, press the up arrow key 6 times to add an extra 6 points. Our next star is a 5-point star with very long points. To draw it, click, hold and drag. While not letting go of your mouse, press the down arrow key to reduce the number of points to 5. Now drag it in to resize it and while still holding your mouse, press the control key on your keyboard and drag the mouse out to get long points. While not letting go of your mouse yet, press the spacebar and move your mouse to reposition the star. Release the spacebar and readjust the star. Our next star has 16 points. So like before, click on it, hold and drag. While still holding it, press the up arrow key 11 times to add more points and reposition it. 
And our final star has also 16 points, but they are even longer. To make this one, click, hold and drag. While still holding it, press the Ctrl key and drag it out. Make it smaller. Press the Ctrl key and drag it out even more. Make it smaller again. And while still holding your mouse, press the space bar and move it up. If you like, you can remove the stroke to get a different effect. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.